Hi guys, welcome to third grade, chapter 10, lesson six. We're gonna go ahead and get started with number two. So all we're doing is measuring in inches. So you can print out a ruler, you can have a ruler with you. I happen to have this one right here. So the biggest thing I wanna say is you will see on my ruler that my ruler actually starts a little bit before the inch does. So you wanna make sure that you're lined up with the inch and not with just the edge of the ruler, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and call that about three inches. So just about, just about to the three. So we're gonna call that right about three inches, okay? So let's go down and do this next one. Line it up with the inch mark. And it is right about one and a half inches. Eh, it's a little shy of that. About one and a quarter inches, one and a half inches. Uh, they're calling it one and a half in the book, but I suppose my little ruler could be off a little bit, so we'll call it one and a half because they do. Okay? All right, we're gonna do one more. Okay, we're gonna line these guys up and that's right about two and three quarters of an inch. So, two and three quarters of an inch. Okay, you guys measure six and seven. Okay, we're gonna go down and do the bottom ones. Draw eight lines that are between one inch and three inches long. Measure each line to the nearest fourth of an inch and make a line plot. Goodness, guys. Okay. We are going to grab our page and we want eight lines that are between one and three inches. Okay, so I'm just gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and do one more right there. Okay, eight. All right, so now if we did a line plot, let's do a line plot where we have one, two, and three. We probably don't need all that extra, so don't worry about that. Okay, so now just whatever the closest Yikes, fourth of an inch, yucky. Okay. All right, so this one, let's measure these guys, okay? Right about three inches. Right about two inches. Right about two and a half inches. So we're gonna put a 2.5 in here. Okay, okay, right about two and a half again. Okay, right about two. Okay, that was that one. About two and a half, and then another two and a half. Okay, and then our, my last one down here is about two and a half again. Okay, and that gives me eight plots. Okay, you guys can do something like that. That's all it wants you to do is to go ahead and do a line plot with your, and you can do it to a quarter of an inch if you want to. I just happened to draw lines that were on the half inches. Okay guys, let's do number nine. It says the tail on Alex's dog is five and a quarter inches long. This length is between which two inch marks on the ruler? So five and a quarter, that's gonna be, if we had five and, there's five, there's six, there'd be five and a quarter. So it would be between five and six. Between five and six, okay? All right, we're gonna go over onto the back. You guys are gonna do the lesson check, just like always, and we're gonna go down and do 
a spiral review. It says write the equations included in the same set of related facts. Ooh, yay. So 8 times 6 is still going to equal 48. Okay. Now when we do the related facts, division is related to... And when you're doing division, you have to put the big number first. So we can do 1 by 6 and 1 by 8, and then that one, there's our 6, we need our 8. There's our 8, we need our 6. There you go. Brooke says there are 49 days until July 4th. There are 7 days in a week. In how many weeks will it be July 4th? So 7 times what is 49? Well, 7 times 7 is 49. So 7 weeks. Okay, it is 20 minutes before 8 o'clock in the morning. What time is it? And use a.m. or p.m. Okay, so there's 8. If I take away 8, I get 750. If I take away another 10, I get 740. There's my 10 and my 10. That's 20, so 740. And when it's in the morning, it's going to be a.m. Done. Okay, Marcy played the piano for 45 minutes. She stopped playing at 415. All right, so 45 minutes is three sets of 15, okay? So, ends at 415. So, I'm gonna do three sets of 15. So if I take away 15 from 415, I get four. If I take away another 15, I get 345. And if I take away another 15, I get 330. So, there's a 15, there's a 15, there's a 15. That's 45 altogether, which means 3.30 p.m. It's in the afternoon, p.m. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out for 10.6. Come on back for 10.7. See you soon.